This evening, MGM Springfield is celebrating the one year anniversary of MGM or Bet MGM Sportsbook and Lounge. 22 News reporter Kaylee Collins is live in studio with a look at the success of the sports betting hubs first year. Nick, Bet MGM Sportsbook and Lounge celebrating turning one today. It was the t this time last year where the first in person sports bet in the state was placed at MGM. Massachusetts became the 33rd U.S. state to get in on legal sports betting action in 2023. In the last year, roughly 150,000 bets have been wagered at the MGM Sportsbook and Lounge, and the state's gaming commission says that BetMGM raked in about $7.9 million in retail tax for Massachusetts between March and December of last year. Newly appointed MGM Springfield COO Louis Theros tells 22 News that he hopes to continue to grow the Sportsbook Lounge as he enters into his new role. It's, gonna, it's always going to be safer the longer you do it, the more we regulate it, and the more people understand how it does work. really want to have people think of MGM Springfield as the destination spot when they come to Springfield in Western Mass. With the Super Bowl right around the corner, business is expected to keep on booming at BetMGM. $1.29 billion is projected to be wagered nationwide on this year's game between the Kansas City Chiefs and the San Francisco 49ers. Working for you, Kaylee Collins, 22 News.